Earlier this week, state police made FBI information public about an unsubstantiated threat that someone was going to attack an Arkansas school on August 29th. Today, we learned of three incidents in Gravit, Springdale, and Paris. Last night, a Gravit Middle School student threatened to shoot fellow students on social media. The Benton County Sheriff's Department and the Gravit Police Department met with the student this morning and apprehended the student. Gravit Superintendent Richard Page says the district acted quickly once it found out about the threat. Knowing also early that the uh, statewide threat was today, we already had support from the Gravit Police Department and then also our teachers are under heightened awareness and more vigilant towards watching for things. So we were already in the prep mode of that. Uh, and so we did the best we could to try to communicate out what we knew uh, and uh, answer some of the uh, questions people might have. Page says he doesn't think this threat was the one the FBI made public, but he thinks the student may have been inspired by it. I think it's, uh, it was uh, a way of, uh, of accelerating the, uh, uh, the opportunity to try to get kids out of school or to create more anxiety for the rest of us. And, and so I do believe that was it was connected. Meanwhile, this morning in Springdale, a 14 year old male student brought a loaded BB gun to school. Police say the gun looked very realistic and similar to a real gun. Springdale Public Schools has 18 school resource officers, more than any other district in Arkansas, according to district spokesperson Rick Schaefer. This is a very unusual incident. Uh, in fact, I think I've done this 14 years. This is the second time we've ever had a student that had a weapon uh, on campus. Schaefer says he doesn't think the student was connected with the FBI's threat. Obviously, this was not the week to do this and uh, because everybody's already on heightened alert. And so, but to speculate that that was part of it, I think would be unfair. The student is in custody at the Washington County Juvenile Detention Center. Also today, two students wrote a threat on a bathroom wall at Paris High School. Both of those students were questioned by police and released into the custody of their parents. Reporting live in Springdale, Emma Claybrook, 4029 News.